What's up everyone, Chris with Dice DGen here. And in today's video we have another matchup in the DGen Crafts Madness. Uh, we're gonna be doing the Uptown Downtown from Vince Armenti against my DGen Triple Threat. All right, so uh, let's hop over to the table, I'll explain how it works, and then uh, we'll roll it out for 20 minutes. PSA here. Uh, I did record a video the other day with uh, Chiro from Midmo Yo, uh, how I, and I did post it this morning, uh, but it was pointed out to me pretty quickly in the comments that there was a mistake on the video. Uh, I did take the puck off, or I didn't take the puck off at the right time. A seven came, and I, I messed it up. Uh, so that video will be redone uh, in a couple days. Uh, Chiro's on vacation right now, so when he gets back, uh, we'll re-record the video. I do want to make it as fair as possible. That was a mistake on my part. Uh, so the round one matchup between Midmo Yo and uh, Color Up with the light to dark and Midmo Yo with his School of Hard Knocks, that will be redone. Uh, so just stay tuned for that. Uh, so, But in this video, we're going to do uh, the Uptown Downtown versus the DJ and Triple Threat. Let's hop over to the table. Let's explain them out and let's roll them out. Alrighty, so we're gonna do uh, the 20 minute roll now. Uh, I have the two bankrolls counted out, $500 in each bankroll. Uh, Vince's bankroll will be right here with the Uptown Downtown, and then uh, my bankroll for the DGEN Triple Threat will be here. I will play Vince on the back uh, portion of the box number here, and then I'll play mine up front just so it's clear, so you can all see it. Uh, I will quickly explain out uh, how these strategies work here. And I will post a picture actually from Vince that he sent me on how the Uptown Downtown works. Uh, he, the picture is great. Um, it, it really details it out very clearly. But uh, basically you play the Uptown, which is the eight, nine, 10, one side, and then the Downtown as a separate side. So uh, you're playing basically Uptown here, Downtown here. The way it starts is uh, $30 on the six and eight, and then uh, $25 on the four, five, nine, and 10. Again, the there's a separation of sorts with the table. The uptown is different than the downtown. They are the same bets, but you're looking to press and collect and stuff like that with just the uptown or just the downtown, all right? So after the first hit at the 30, 25, 25 level, then it comes down to a 12, 10, 10, and you rack. On the next hit, you're gonna press it back up to that 35, or sorry, 30, 25, 25 level. All right? Uh, for the DGEN triple threat, um, it was made on for a $15 table. I'm just gonna leave it for a $15 table, even though this is a $10 table for the challenge. Uh, you go 118 across, so 15 on the four and 10, 20 on the five and nine, 24 on the six and eight. You're looking for three hits. After that third hit, you're gonna regress down to 66 inside. So 15 on the five and nine, 18 on the six and eight. After that, I'm gonna do a half press. Uh, so like the $15 on the five, let's say a five hits, it'll pay me $18. Actually, it won't pay me 18, it'll pay me $21. So 15 will pay me 21. I'm gonna take that up to a $25 five. Same thing with the nine. And uh, you'll see how it goes going out. All right, uh, so we have $500 here. All right, again, the Uptown Downtown will be on the back here. DGEN Triple Threat will be up front. We have a timer set for 20 minutes. And uh, let's have this go. So also, uh, for the Uptown Downtown, you're working on the come out. So I'm gonna set that up before I uh, start the timer here. So it's set up with 25, 25, 30, 30, 25, 25, all right? And uh, have the dice, so let's pick some dice here. Not too many, too many reds up there. All right, uh, we'll start the timer and uh, let's get this going, all right? 20 minutes starting now. Here we go, shooter one coming out. And we have a seven, five, two, seven. Uh, 
that is a big loser for the uptown downtown uh, these were working on the come out as I said uh, so those are gonna have to be replaced all right uh, same shooter still looking for a point we have a 628 easy eight that'll be our point all right, so uh, for the uptown, right, Vince is gonna get paid 35 for his 30, and he's gonna come down on all these bets to make it look like 12, 10, 10, so $32. So I'm gonna leave the 35 here. I'll put the rest back in his rack. All right, so that's gonna come down here to a single unit on each of these, right? And then he's gonna get $3 change, so we'll put that in the rack there. And for me, I'm going 118 across. Um, so drop 120 to the dealers. And we're going 118 across. So 15 on the four and 10, 20 on the five and nine, and then uh, $24 on the um, six and eight. That's gonna return me two change as well. All right, we are all set up here. And uh, shooter has the dice. Five, two, seven, seven out. All right, so there's a dreaded point seven. Uh, all these bets are gonna come down here for everyone. gonna go off and uh, we're coming back up with the uptown downtown for Vince up top here uh, these are again working my bets are off here we go shooter looking for a point six six hard that'll be our point all right so that's gonna pay 35 again for the 30 and again this is gonna go down to um, one unit bet on each, so it's going to be 32. And three change. And then uh, I'll be set up again with my uh, 118 across. It's 120 there. And again, while I'm setting this up, uh, I'm assuming that uh, you know none of us are the shooter here, that it's just a random roll from a random shooter at the table. Um, everyone shoots a little differently for some of their strategies, so uh, I'm not them, I can't replicate how they shoot, so I'm just assuming they're not shooting, so we don't need a pass line or a don't pass. Some of these strategies don't involve those. Uh, so just as a warning that they're, neither one of us is considered the shooter here, we're gonna have other people at the table shooting. All right, here we go, shoot number two. We have a 628 easy eight. All right, so uh, for Vince, it's gonna pay again 35, and he's gonna come down here to uh, one unit again on each of these numbers here. Three change, this will go to the bank here. And then uh, my $24 eight is gonna pay 28. All right, I'm just gonna add that to my rack. Shooter has the dice. We have a four, two, six. That is a point hit. All right, so the puck will come off. Uh, my $24 six is gonna pay 28 again. Uh, Vince here is gonna get paid 15 for one. Uh, so I'm gonna rack mine first. Here. And then Vince is getting 15 for one. All right, and then he's gonna take this back up 
to uh, the starting unit. So 25, 25, 30. All right, racking the rest here. And again, his bets are working on the come out, which is coming up. Mine are off. All right. And we have a 617. 617. So these bets will come down here. And uh, this will need to be replaced. Five there. Just do that to make it a little cleaner here. All right, uh, again, my bets are off. Back row here is working. Shooter's looking for a point. Got a, a six three nine center field nine. That will be the point. All right, uh, again, 35 on the uh, back row here. These are gonna come down now. So we'll rack this. And we're gonna go to a single unit here across. And three dollars change. And uh, my bets are set up; they're good to go. Uh, looking for that uh, third hit on mine. We have two. We're looking for the third hit, and then we'll regress down to sixty-six inside. Six hard six. All right. So uh, Vince again for the uptown downtown thirty-five. He's coming down. So I'm gonna just rack all of this. Again, it's thirty-two dollars. All right, uh, I need some more singles here. I'm gonna get three change here. All right, so this go to his rack. This is going here. Now for me, my six is gonna get paid 28. All right, I am racking this, and I'm also coming down on my bets. So the four and 10 are coming down, and then uh, the six and eight are gonna be dropped to 18. So I have 15 on the five and nine, and then, um, 18 on the six and eight and the rest of this will go back into my bank here All right, and like I said, I'm gonna be half pressing uh, from here on out for mine and we're gonna continue with the uptown downtown for Vince 10 10 hard uh, 10 is gonna pay 18 what I'm gonna do is uh, 20 for 2 and again, I don't remember if I said it or not. I'm not worrying about vigs and stuff uh, so I know that um, there are VIGs on the four and 10. I'm not worrying about them. I don't think it's gonna make a huge difference in the grand scheme of things here. All right, so I'm not worrying about them. Uh, so these bets are gonna come down and we're gonna go back up here to uh, 25, 25 and 30, returning the rest to the rack here. And uh, shooters got the dice. And we have a 6177 out. All right, so puck's gonna come off. These bets all come down. All right, uh, I'm gonna have to make some change here uh, for Vince's uptown downtown here with the 25s. So uh, give them some greens here. So four greens there. Hundred dollars, hundred dollars. Put this off to the side here, and uh, just so everyone knows, we have about uh, eleven minutes remaining. Uh, so Vince is working on the come out, right? So he's working. I am not working. So um, just have dice there. Shooter number three. You have a 314 for easy. That'll be our point. Uh, it's going to pay 50 here, right? And um, these are going to come down. And we're going to go 32 uh, on the downtown portion here. So we'll rack the rest and we'll get that set up for Vince and his strategy. And then uh, for me, we're going 118 across. Right, so 100, it's 
and I get two change off of that because uh, I dropped 120 and I'm going 118. All right, so uh, we're all set up here, and uh, shooter has the dice. We have a 10, 10 hard. All right, so again, Vince is going to get 50, right, and he's coming down to 32 here. All right, so we'll rack this for him. And then uh, we'll get set up here. All right. And then uh, I'm getting paid 30 for my 10. So I'm just going to rack that. Uh, it's leaner there, but it would be a 7. It would be a 6 1 7 out. So uh, these bets all come down, point comes off. Be a great day for a dark side strategy. Fortunately, we're both playing the light side today. Alrighty, uh, let's get this set up again. And uh, these are working. Mine are off. I don't have any bets out there. Got a new shooter looking for a point. Got a yo 11, 6, 5, yo. Doesn't matter. Got a 4, 1, 5, 5 fever. That'll be our point. All right. Again, paying 35 for uh, Vince here. I'm going to drop $2, make 32, and we will rack the rest of this for him. All right, so it's going to come down to, again, 10, 10, 12. And then uh, get set up here with mine. Again, drop 118. on the six and eight. All right, we're set up, we're ready to go. Got a one, two, three, craps shocker. Doesn't matter for either one of us. Back to back shockers. I see a horn, bet a horn, right? Got a five, three, eight, easy eight. Uh, it's going to pay 35 for Vince here, right? What I'm going to do is I'm going to take these down, drop $2. So 32, we'll rack the rest for him. And uh, get set up here. All right, he is set up. This is going to the bank. Uh, my $24.8 is going to pay 28. And we're just going to rack that. Shooter has the dice. Five one six. So uh, it's gonna pay. Twelve is gonna pay fourteen. So we'll do fifteen for one. All right. And then uh, we're gonna take this all down here, put it back in the rack, and we're going back up to uh, thirty-five. No, sorry, thirty twenty-five twenty-five. My twenty-four dollars six is getting paid. 28 that's hit number two for me so i'm just racking this for now and uh shooter has the dice got a four hard four all right so vince is getting paid 50 here right and then uh he's gonna come down to 32 dollars. so again just drop that we'll rack the rest of this for him Alrighty, and then uh, for me, my 15 is getting paid 30. All right, these are coming down. These are coming down a unit, and then uh, we're set up with 66 inside, racking the rest here, and uh, see how it goes. We have a 415. Four one five. It's the point. Puck will come off. All right. Uh, so 
for me, I'm getting paid $21. I'm gonna press this up to 25, make it a $25 five, rack the rest. All right, for Vince, he's getting paid 14, so 15 for one. And then these are going to come back to the rack for him. And we're gonna go back to that 25, 25, 30 setup. All right, uh, puck is off. My bets are off. Uptown, downtown is working. All right, and we got about uh, four minutes left in this challenge. We have a 516. That would be our new point. All right. And again, uh, so Vince's was working. 30 is going to pay 35. Again, we'll drop the $2 here and we will rack the rest for him. All right. My bets were off. Uh, so I'm set up, ready to go. Here we go. 10, hard 10. All right, so 10 is going to pay 20. All right, and then uh, these bets are gonna go up again, right? So we'll rack all of this, and then uh, we're gonna go forward again, um, 25, 25, 30, all right? You have a three, or sorry, a two, one, three, shocker. You have a nine, center field nine, uh, for me, again, it's going to pay 21, right? Drop two, take that up to 25. Go to the bank, we'll rack the rest here. Uh, $25.9 is going to pay 30. Again, we'll drop, or sorry, 35. We'll drop two for 32 here. And then uh, the rest of this will get returned to the rack. set up here get some more red chips have a six two eight easy eight all right so uh, my eighteen dollar eight is also gonna pay 21 right and now I'm going to drop a dollar here take 12 and rack the other 10 so to take this to a thirty dollar eight all right, so it's eighteen dollar eight dropping twelve thirty dollar eight. All right, and uh, Vince here is going to win fifteen or fourteen for one, so we'll do fifteen for one here. So he wins fourteen dollars total, and then again this is coming down and going back up to the strategy here. Put him over in this rack. All right, and uh, there we go. So that was an eight. All right, so uh, we got 55 seconds left. Here we go. Got a three one four. It's gonna pay twenty dollars for uh, Vince here, and we're going back up with his strategy. And he's racking this here. All right, and we have a four, three, seven, seven out. All right, uh, there is 12 seconds left. What I'm gonna do is uh, we're gonna do one more shooter since technically I would be shooting uh, one more time here. I do need to change out some chips here for uh, Vince. Uh, timer is going off now. Like I said, we're gonna do uh, one more shooter uh, since we ended with time still on the clock. All right, so that's how it's gonna work. We will consider it a new shooter until we hit the zero for any challenge here. All right, so we're setting him up here. 
And again, I want to preface this by saying I have no clue how this is going to work out. All right, I'm saying this before I'm actually rolling it out. So we're just going to finish out the roll since there was like 15 seconds left on the clock. Um, and let's see how it goes. All right, so new dice here. These are on. We have a six, hard six. Be the point. It's going to pay 35. Right, and this is coming down all of this, and it's going to be $32 here. The rest of that will get racked. And I am dropping 118. Actually 120 here. Um, and we'll get set up. Two dollars change for me, and we need the caps here. All right, so we're set up. It's going back to my rack here. Let's see what happens. Five one six. It's a point hit. All right. Uh, my bet is going to get paid twenty eight. We're just racking that. All right. Uh, Vince here is getting paid fourteen, so we'll do fifteen for one. Okay. And this is now getting pressed up again. So I'm going to return this to him. I'll keep the five here. All right. His bets are on, my bets are off. Looking for a point. Got a three, two, five. It's gonna pay 35 here, right? And again, I'm gonna drop the $2 here and we will rack the rest of this for him. Right, he's going down here. Need some more red chips. Probably some more whites here. All right, uh, we're all set up here. There we go. Got a six three nine. All right, so for me, it's gonna pay twenty eight as well. Racking that. That's hit number two for me. Uh, it's going to pay 35 here, right? And then uh, Vince is coming down, so I'm going to drop again $2 here. This will get returned to the rack. And we will get this set up here. All right. Here we go. 10, 10 hard. Gonna pay 20 to uh, Vince here, All right? So that's 20, and this is coming back up now. The rest of this is going to the rack for him. All right. Uh, the dice rolled there, but that was a 10, hard 10. Uh, and then I'm getting 30 here, and that was hit number three, right? So we're bringing our bets down. Ready to go here. We have a four, three, seven, seven out. All right. Uh, so all these bets will come down. All right. Uh, these racks look relatively close. I think Vince might have me. I'm not sure. Let's see here. Let's count his out first. All right. So uh, for Vince's Uptown Downtown, it's 125.
All right, so uh, for Vince, we have 100. This is 200 here, all right? This will be 300. This is 75, 80, 85, 86. So 386 uh, for Vince here. Write that down. Oh, that's pointing back at me, sorry. Uh, Three, I can't write upside down. 386, it's gonna be facing me. Might be upside down to you, my apologies. I just can't write upside down. All right, so 386 there. And for my rack, what do we have here? Yeah, 150. change these in here for a, another green chip all right because uh, that was $25 worth of ones and I'll change this in for two reds all right so we have 100 200 300 this is uh, 50 370 373, so 373, which means uh, Vince is uptown, downtown, will advance to the next round. Uh, very close there, very, very close, uh, $13 separation. Uh, we were playing, both playing the light side there. Uh, so congrats to Vince and his uptown, downtown. I need to cross that off since I made that mistake earlier and we were recording that one. Uh, but congrats to Vince there and his uptown downtown. Uh, great strategy. I do like this one um, a lot. And uh, you can see, played out decently today. Beat the DGen triple threat. Uh, both ended up losing, which is not ideal, but there was uh, quite a few 0.7s, short rolls, stuff like that. Uh, so that is the uptown downtown versus DGen triple threat. Uh, I want to thank you guys for watching. Uh, don't forget to subscribe to my channel, subscribe to Vince's, it'll be linked down below. And uh, I'll catch you guys in the next video. Um, we'll have more matchups coming on a daily basis. Uh, so stay tuned for those. And uh, turn on the notifications if you do not want to miss them. All right. Uh, thank you guys for watching. I'll catch you in the next video. Peace.